How long do you actually need to be outside in the morning to get the real metabolic and hormone benefits of sunlight? This is one of the top questions I get. And one important key is LUX, which measures light intensity. Now indoors, you're typically going to max out at 300 and that's with really bright overhead lights on. And if you step outside in the morning, that can jump easily to 1,000 to 30,000 LUX, even on cloudy days. So brightness is one of the main signals that sets your circadian rhythm, regulates hormones, and programs your metabolism for the entire day but light boxes fall short in that they can be bright, but they don't give you full spectrum light. They're mostly unfiltered blue light. They lack the balancing red and infrared wavelengths, and they have no UV. UVA light in particular triggers hormone cascades that affect appetite, mitochondrial function, and thyroid signaling, as well as nitric oxide, serotonin, and dopamine. So a light box can't replicate what sunlight does. So how long do we stay outside? That's why we're watching. <laughs> Here's what the research has found. 500 lux for 30 minutes daily was enough to influence BMI and appetite regulation. 1300 lux for 45 minutes each morning led to measurable changes in body composition and metabolic markers. 4,300 lux or 10,000 lux for 30 minutes three times a week produced even greater effects on body fat and appetite regulation. Natural sunlight easily reaches those intensities without needing special equipment. Now, I'm not saying you have to start at 45 minutes. Do if you can, but even 10 to 15 minutes outside in real morning light is better than nothing. Start with what's realistic, maybe while you drink your coffee or walk your dog, and build from there. The more consistently you do that, the stronger the signal. Now, how do you measure Lux? You could actually use the Lux meter in my circadian app to see what your Lux is outdoors, even on those rainy, cloudy days. Typically, I see people getting anywhere from 500 to 10,000. Comment or DM the word app, and I'll send you the link to download.